Geotropism. My name is Charlie Haffey. I am an elementary science teacher for the Norwood Public Schools. What is geotropism? Geo comes from the Greek word geo. It means the earth. Tropism comes from the Greek tropos, which means turning. Geotropism. A plant grows or turns in response to gravity. Positive geotropism. Plant parts grow towards gravity. This is usually seen in roots. How does this happen? If we look at the smallest living part of a plant or animal, that would be a cell. When we're dealing with cells, we're going to be needing the millimeter scale of distance. Here we have a brand new pencil. The eraser has a width or a diameter of about five millimeters. If we look at a brand new Crayola crayon, the tip on that crayon has a diameter or width of about two millimeters. And if we look at a first grader's favorite tool, the brand new sharpened pencil, the pencil tip has a diameter or width of one millimeter, about. Onion skin cells. Large plant cells, at least compared to other plants. They are about 0.25 millimeters to 0.50 millimeters in length. Here's a picture that I took through a microscope of some onion skin cells. And just for argument's sake, let's say that this cell here is 0.25 millimeters long, one quarter of a millimeter. If we go back to our pencil, we would say that four of those onion skin cells, end to end, would be as wide as a pencil dot. How do cells grow? There are plant chemicals called growth hormones. Growth hormones move in the plant in response to gravity. As plant growth hormones change, some cells grow faster, some cells grow larger. Here I have a very simple example of a root. The outside would be these solid lines. The cells on the inside would be these little boxes inside those solid lines. The bottom of the root, which is where the root grows, would be down here. Gravity is always pulling the root down. The growth hormones are evenly spread out at the bottom of the root where the root grows. So the root grows down. If you turn the root on its side, the growth hormones move in the root tip, the part where the root grows. The top cells in that root tip get bigger, and the root grows like this. Negative geotropism. Plant parts grow away from gravity, usually seen in stems. Some people get confused by the concept of negative geotropism. This is a negative sign. You know it as a minus sign or a subtraction sign. So when you say negative, you could also talk about subtract. You could talk about minus. We talk about take away. 
So think of negative geotropism is when plants move away from gravity. Here we have a stem. Again, very simple. The outside are these solid green lines. The cells would be these little boxes on the inside. Now the part of the stem that grows is the very top of the stem. That is where the plant gets taller from the top of the stem. Gravity pulls down the growth hormones in the stem are evenly spread out. So the stem grows up. If you turn the stem on its side, gravity is still pulling it down. The growth hormones move in the stem, particularly in the tip where the stem gets longer. The lower cells get bigger and the stem grows like this. In review, root hormones move when the plant gets tipped over. The cells in the root top grow larger, the roots grow down, and this is called positive geotropism. When the plant tips over, stem hormones move. The bottom cells of the stem tip grow larger. The stem grows up. And this is called negative geotropism. This has been geotropism. My name is Charlie Haffey. I am an elementary science teacher for the Norwood Public Schools.